it's a layered no that's what i mean like i asked him then sent the screenshot to nate to oh make my fun of god him. hold up yeah, time out too. time the fuck out this document has 58 fucking pages seth this guy seth is a menace 58 pages bro but who would have thought a 21 year old would act like that I understand, like, the cop lobbies back in the day, the shit was wild. I'm not even going to lie. But, bro, you talking about molesting a four-year-old. Then, bro, got caught sexually harassing 14, 15-year-old girl, bro. Come on, Seth. At 21, we cannot be talk, even conversate with no last girl, bro. You are a cat teen, bro. You are a cat -ing. And I fuck with you. But... Bro, 58 pages? Come on, bro. Yes. yes. I, I told that's why you need to watch the fucking a video on it, man. There's too much to talk about just like off the fucking dome. It's like it's like a heavily constructed college essay. Like, Everyone's you know, manipulating but you, right? Everyone's wrong but you. We're just all talking about your Bro, you're bro. Like, bro. How? Okay. Wait, wait, guys. Time out. Time out. You guys, you guys are throwing like 500 th no, things at me. I understand. I understand. And it's not even and it's not even concise. One minute you'll be talking about me trying to dox noodles, and the next you'll be like, Are you a predator? And then you'll be like, I'm, ago. Let's go back to how you treated how let's go back to how you treated Clyde. Noodle. It's like it's all noodles. Things, noodle, stop talking. Noodle, go on mute. Noodle, What's go that? on mute. Noodle, go right, on mute. It. Noodle, go on mute. Seth. All right. Let's 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 bring down the temperature here. All right. You are getting hit with a bunch of stuff. So I apologize that, you know, the questions just go left and right. But me and Pat God. It, it literally is not concise. It's not, it's hold not on. solving anything. Hold on. Me and Pat God are learning about a lot of this stuff for the very first time. All right. When I see a document yes. of 58 fucking pages. I, I know. I know everyone did. It was it's, insane. It's hard to <laughs> like, say. It's hard to say to this document. Oh, it's all bullshit. It's all jo all just jokes. It's hard. What is real? What are you actually guilty of? Because Noodles pressing you, saying like you were in DMs, you offer to fly someone out, you're asking if, if someone's a virgin or not. I mean, those aren't jokes. Come on, like what is real? Yes. Okay, they are jokes in the sense like of the context uh, of what I'm saying them for. So I know it sounds crazy, but you need to go over off? you need to go yeah, but, over each one, but, like and why it's a joke. joke. Even if they're jokes, the point is that you're making sexual jokes with a sixteen year old when you're in your early twenties and you live I'm in I'm not in my life. early twenties. I'm nineteen. Show okay, some ID like, right now. Show some ID okay, right let's now. Let's show yeah. my fucking like thing. Like so when when people let's talk about what, what I know about satire's age in this situation. OK, like and there, the, you need context for the situation like that's that's the problem. I know it looks bad to an audience that doesn't know anything about anybody involved. I know that. And that's why it takes so long to fucking explain it, because I, I dug myself such a crazy fucking hole in my actions. But the thing about satire is that she was in my server. She had a crush. Well, she didn't have a crush, but a, a guy named Nate had a crush on her. OK, um, Nate was an adult. Um, and then she she was dating an um, admin in my server named Cheese, who was an adult. So I figured she was older anyway, but I'm not like five or eight years older than her either. You know what I mean? And like I said earlier, it links back to the way that I used to have a barrier with how I talk to everyone. Cause I used to say stupid shit, like let me fuck a four year old till they cry or something. Like what that was just, the... that was, that was just shock Dude. fucking disavow. That, shock value that I used to say, and I know it's, it's like, it's, it's indefensible. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Like no matter how anybody says that, that just pisses me off, bro. Like, I know, uh, and I know it does. Like, and I know it's fucking stupid. Like, I know it is. And because I was growing up on the internet, these people always love to bring up shit I did when I was like 19 and I had no fucking filter or barrier. And that's literally how I was. And it's just consistent. It's always consistent. And you guys are like, oh, no, it's a stack of evidence. No, it's just consistent fucking shit behavior. Like, that's just how okay, I was. Seth, do you do And it was all public. You know what I mean? Do you? Wait, 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 wait. Let me ask you a question, Seth. Based on all this shit behavior, are you fucking a danger to the kids that are in this fucking community? To the kids that are going onto the Discord, to the kids that are into the live stream chats, Discord, to so the kids. Hold on, you no. did have a Discord. You did. Are you a danger? Well, a long time. Seth, this, I'll be quiet. I'll be quiet. I this promise. stuff is this stuff is fucking bad. All right. People are looking at you like you're yes. a danger to the fucking kids in this community because yes. of this shit. 
You're saying it's just jokes. Okay, let's say you're right, all right? All 58 pages, I don't joke like this every anymore. interaction, no. all these fucking yes. jokes are jokes that yes. you're still fucking and I go up. Over it. I went over like, why all of them were. I went over the context and why every single one of them were and what they meant and why I said them all in this video. Hour and a half long. Okay, but... Also, and I, know, like, and I, I know it's a comp and you guys are asking for like a basic summary of why I have all this shit when each single situation no, needs an explanation. Seth, wait, hold up. Cause let me, let me actually say something. Cause this is bothering me and it keeps bothering me this entire time. This is from 2017. Okay. Look at the dates five years ago. Okay. Now I, I just don't understand because Clyde said he's been working with you since like 2017. So yes. like, why the fuck is this like I don't understand why is this now the problem right because it's why fucking is Clyde, bullshit why man is Doodle, why are you guys associating with this fucking guy who's doing this weird shit and I mean obviously this is not just fucking clearing you but it just doesn't make sense why the fuck I can explain does it, it have to take five years five fucking Pat God years has a point for us Pat to God about has this a shit. point can I this? go ahead noodle not gonna lie shout out my boy Pat guy he does have a point why I, why it took y'all five years if y'all knew he was a sexual deviant, a motherfucking fucking predator, Chris Hansen need to fucking, need to, he need to talk with Chris Hansen, man. If y'all knew Seth was a motherfucking deviant, why it take y'all five years to expose him? I know it said it took him two years to make the video and shit, but five years, so the other three years you was just working with him? I don't get it. So yeah, like I didn't know about it personally. So, but there yes, were documents. Did, Hold on, are. no, I didn't. Not until later. But anyway, um, there were documents that came out on Seth, but nobody had the platform at the time. Seth went on stream and like tried to de debunk it all or whatever, just saying they're all jokes, like he is now. Okay, so it did happen before. It, it has happened multiple times before. Satire came out in 2018 and talked about it. The thing is, nobody's had the platform or the effort to push it into the limelight yet. But they're with why the it community, wait a minute. That have no context. Wait a minute, but Noodles, Noodles, Clyde was his fucking editor this entire yeah. time. Clyde was accepting payments from this guy who he's supposedly deeming as a pedophile, allowing him to give him money to edit videos for him. Exactly. Why the fuck is Dude, Clyde? Like, and and here's, no, 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 here's the other thing about Noodles, too. Oh noodles hey, Noodles is going to call me a pedophile and attack the fuck out of me, but he was going to be willing. He, he, was willi I mean, he was willing to be my friend. He was willing Seth, to be Seth, my friend and work things out. Just I a fuck know, a few a months ago. Recently, so. Wait a second. Noodles, there is a difference. There is a major fucking difference between Clyde separating himself from fucking um, Seth and not exposing anything because he's scared or whatever, right? Okay, you so let me explain this to you. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Let me finish. Noodles, Please, 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 let me finish. Everyone on mute except for Pat God. Everybody on mute. Until until later when he feels I can expose him. I can explain it. It's but, really simple, but, dude. But Seth, so, firstly, Seth is you cuck, you cuck. fucking working with them in a business relationship for fucking five years. Yeah, I can explain Seven. it. You, you know, Seth is a manipulator. He is a gaslighter. He is the type of person to lie about things. And Clyde believed him. And Clyde has come out and said that he shouldn't have did that. So it's obvious, dude. Yeah, like, now Clyde just Clyde, Clyde just suddenly yeah. just doesn't believe me anymore after sudden. all these years. Five years. Yeah, it's years. not like it's not, it's not like, it's not like he it's hasn't read all these docs and heard every argument. He just he suddenly he, he doesn't did. agree with it anymore. Even though nothing, new, nothing new happened. He believed you. Nothing new has changed. This is the same doc. This isn't a new doc. There's no new info to change Clyde's mind. He's just being fake about it. How about how about you holding money over his head for a whole two years, pinning him financially? Okay, stop, 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 stop. Let me talk. That? Let me talk. Wait a minute, all right. Wait, a minute, wait, wait. wait. Let me talk. Together. Let me talk. God damn it. Everybody mute. Everybody mute. Everybody mute. Everybody mute. Okay. Noodle. You mean to tell me that fucking Seth uh blackmailed um um fucking um Clyde over money, threatened Clyde with a bunch of stuff. Don't talk yet. I I'm not done talking yet, Noodle. I swear to God, I will I will be the me and fucking Walmart dude are going to be Eskimo brothers. Just chill. You mean to tell me that Seth and um, that Seth blackmailed and like threatened Clyde with all this stuff that he was going to fire him or not pay him the money he owed him. So Clyde didn't expose him for being a pedo. What? 
Um, so basically what had... Uh, basically, what had happened was um, Seth had paid him at the beginning of the year. I don't remember which year it was exactly. He paid him a flat contract, right? It was like, I think it was like 10K for the whole year or something crazy. It was a really small amount, but he paid him for that. Um, Clyde didn't have a lot of money at the time, and he had just moved out. He was financially in a bad position, um, and Seth basically was helping him at the time with the money to be able to pay for his own apartment and shit like that. I have that. a follow-up um, question. And when... Uh, all these documents started coming wait, out. Wait, I have a, I want to say something. I have a follow-up question. I haven't even finished the story okay. Yet. No, I understand your okay, point well, that he that he was in a. You're telling me that Clyde was in a rough situation and needed the money. That's what you're saying. Yes. That's the story you're yes, telling me. Did. Okay, I got it. Yes, and I don't need all this in his video. Too. I got it. I don't okay. need all the details. My point is this. All right. So he he picked money over. Telling the audience that there was an online predator, an online pedo, he, he picked money oh, over telling people. He didn't think he was people. a pedophile back then. Noodles? He didn't think he was a pedophile. Noodles? Wait a minute. Yeah, wait a minute. Wait a reason. minute. I hate, no, I hate no that reason. I have to even come to Seth's defense right now. But, but in all fairness, okay, Clyde is a fucking grown ass man, and if he wants to take a bunch of money from fucking Seth up front for shit, then he's causing a whole bunch of problems for himself. When I get my videos edited, I find Obviously, an editor, dude. I tell them exactly what I want, they edit the video, and then I pay them. We would Obviously, never, I would never send someone 10K up front to do that. I, and I would never accept that. Did, if, if Clyde is having money being held over his head, that's Clyde's fucking fault for accepting Hold that. Hold on, you don't know the fucking situation. He was in a fucking abusive household, and he had to move out because of it. His how the fuck used to beat the fuck that, out of him. Hold on, stop, I'm not done talking. He was in an abusive household, and he needed that. I saved him to from. be able to get the fuck out of there. So you don't that know the I fucking saved him from, dumbass. So stop acting like you fucking do. Go get some fucking context. Go watch Clyde's fucking video because you don't know the nuance. Well, I just I have I have to add to I have someone to add in here that has like more context on the the